Right, another bit of essential equipment for doing what I do, how I do it, is this jobby, which is a set of timber tongs. That's fine, eh? Do two sizes. They do a bigger one. When I bought these, I thought if I got the bigger one, I'd have to move bigger lumps of timber. Because at that time I was working as a sawman in the winters. And I decided I didn't want to shift huge lumps of timber. Because our job was basically to fell material quite like this. And then uh, stack it for uplift. So in bunches about the size of a, uh, a forestry timber grab. So he basically had to move these from stump to where he came through. Say the forwarder came through this, this area here. See this uh, gap between the, the stools? You could get a forwarder through there quite handily. So basically you'd move these, pick them up like that and then shift them along. You can see if you take it at the balance point you can carry this quite handily without having to bend all the way over. So I use them like that. Very, very good. If it's been raining and all this green stuff, which is an alga called Chlorococcus, gets very, very slippery. So if it's been raining, then you use these rather than get your gloves all covered in mank and all wet. And also, because you're lifting it like that, if your hands are getting a bit past it like mine, that's much easier than trying to grab something like that, or like that. Also, you don't have to bend down so far if you're picking something up. There's a wretched helicopter again. Every time I get the camera out, the helicopter flies over. Oh, I think it's the army or the marines or somebody. Anyway. So, oh, timber tongs, very, very useful indeed. And I've had these a dozen years, uh, still going strong.